Hello and welcome to Indian News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnaka. News in detail. A sigh of relief for the people as the malls and shopping complex are open in Nagpur from today. However, food courts, restaurants and food zones will continue to remain closed with only home delivery available. The malls will stay open from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. The Nagpur Municipal Corporation has stated that if the rules and regulations are not followed properly, they will have to face the action. The relaxation are being provided by the state government under Unlock 3.0. Mission begin again. As the malls and shopping complexes are open, the only one who can ensure your safety on a day out of shopping is you. Unlock 3.0 has getting back to the new normal, but there are a couple of precautions you need to take to stay ahead of the coronavirus. Whether it's visiting the newest stores at the mall or going out to our favorite restaurants, stepping out comes with various responsibilities and protocols you need to adhere to. for your own safety and for the safety of those around you dear 2020 due to the corona epidemic no one wanted to remember even the dreams this 5 august 2020 has given a reason to remember this year this date and this day will remember forever in history on this day bhumi pujan was performed for the rama temple in ayodhya the birthplace of lord shri ram and the foundation stone was laid here this program filled the country with enthusiasm and the whole country became ram mai this ram mai enthusiasm was also seen in santra nagari the chanting of ram nama started at various premises in nagpur city sweets were being distributed rangolis were decorated at the squares saffron flags were waved at homes in the city ram dex gar temple in the city which was closed due to the lockdown worship was also done there the people The whole country was waiting for this day. This day's happiness was seen everywhere. Aarti was organized on behalf of Vishwa Hindu Parishad and Bajrang Dal at Shivaji Kutla. At the same time, Nitin Gadkari also did puja archana with the entire family by staying at his residence. Today was not less than a Diwali for all the people of the country. Nagpur's first private COVID-19 dedicated hospital Bukhar was found violating the guideline and demanding extra charges from the patient. The hospital received a notice from Nagpur Municipal Corporation on Tuesday for not following the guidelines of the said price which was set by the government. A team had visited Bukhar Hospital Gandhinagar. The Maharashtra state government had already set the price for all the private hospitals treating the COVID-19 positive patients. According to the set price, 80% of the bed was said to be controlled and priced with government while 20% of the beds were reserved the union public service commission has released the result of the civil services exam 2019 at the official website from nagpur six candidates passed this exam prasad shinde secured rank 287 ashish kamle backed rank 651 pradnya khandare secured 719 rank nikhil dubey secured rank 733 sumit ramtek secured rank 748 Swarup Dikshit secured rank 827 based on the results of the written part of the civil services examination 2019 held in September and the interviews for personal test held in February and August a total of 829 candidates have passed this exam this year around 114 students had registered for the exam from Nagpur out of which 17 cleared this test and 6 cleared from final civil services exam most of the qualified candidates almost 304 are from the general category the candidates have been recommended for indian administrative services that is ias indian foreign services ifs and indian police services ips amongst other civil services the corporation administration has set up 5000 bed covid care center in the premises of radha swami satsang mandal on kalmeshwar mark Pintu Jalke, chairperson of the standing committee, who gave a surprise visit, reviewed the campus on Tuesday. After which, Jalke said that 35 lakhs was wasted, which was used for COVID center. The condition of the COVID center in five hospitals of Nagpur Municipal Corporation is similar to that of the Radha Swami Satsang Mandal. Jalke demanded an inquiry into the matter. As per information, only 500 beds have been provided in the place of 5,000 to the center. However, as it is not possible to keep patients here on rainy days, standing committee chairman Pintu Jalke paid a surprise visit to the COVID center on Tuesday. Mattresses were rolled up to on 200 beds here. Several beds were found to be wet due to 
water leakage in case of heavy rains water leaks in places in the shed the stagnant water in the area flows through the shed the toilet arrangement is outside the shed but if rain heavily it is not possible to get there the bears here are firmly in the budget rain a lot of money was spent on pillows sheets and other material but they were not kept properly so far no patients has been placed in the center pintu jal ke inform that there is no such arrangement here municipal commissioner tukaram mandi did not trust the office bearers while setting up the center pintu jal ke alleged that this situation has arisen due to this well that's all from this bulletin for more updates in and around the city please stay tuned with nbc news till then ratnagar says goodbye please do take good care of yourself